What about you? Are you a fucking fraud? Are you a fraud? If you become this person I'm talking about, you will never miss a cell again. Never. Till I collapse, I'll be moving too fast. Got my foot up on the gas, full throttle till I crash. I'm back with the vengeance. You gonna see me yet? I was a loser and I learned how to be a winner. These three things right here, everybody write this down. Be a psycho competitor. Fucking psycho! You must rip their throats out if they're gonna compete against you. Do you understand? Okay, listen, God forgive me for the message I'm gonna give today. I mean it. I mean it. You guys all pray for me on this one, but I'm gonna change your life. Jesus flipped the tables over. He got pissed too. Okay, and some of you need a table fucking flipping right now. You got it? All right, number two, one, number one, be a psycho competitor. This is rule number one. Some of you, you're asleep. I look in your eyes. The eyes are the window to the soul. You're asleep. Today's the awakening. If you want to insulate yourself against the world where no one can compete with you, you will become the greatest leader that's ever existed. I'm going to tell you how to do it today. You guys want to know how to do it? Yeah. All right, let me ask you a question. Don't lie to me either. If I teach you guys today how I changed my entire life, and I literally tell you systematically how to do it, will you do it? Yes. Okay, number two, do you want me to feed you ice cream like a two, three, four, five-year-old make you feel good and motivate you? Or do you want me to give you the cold, hard truth? Okay, you gave me fucking permission. Okay, so I don't want somebody in a little bit, in case I call someone on stage, to be like, oh man, I am fucking embarrassed. Shut your mouth. Okay? Good. I'm glad you get embarrassed. Okay? Everybody write down, bet against me. We're going to loop back to this in a minute because all of this, number one, being a psycho competitor is about thinking about everybody that bet against you. And by the way, it better not fucking be you. And that's why if you listen to what my wife said, she's the one that holds me accountable. And I do not like this. I try to run from accountability. It's always a fight, but she's always right. I love... She's always right. Listen, dude, hey, a lot of you in here, if, you, hey, if you're married to a woman, her intuition, I guarantee you, 99% of the time is way better than yours. Women have this natural intuition gift where they can be like, that's a bad guy. And you're like, babe, but you don't understand. And then four months later, you got fucking burned. She's like, why? I told you. And you're like, yeah, but no, dude, you don't listen. And by the way, some of you in here, the reason why your girl doesn't tell you anymore is because you fucking shut her up and you don't listen to her. Now she doesn't warn you anymore. And how stupid would it be to have your best friend, your protector, who's going to be with you until you die, not feel like she can fucking warn you? Okay, some of you, you, listen, hey, today, there's two rules to business. Number one, don't ever let anyone know your business better than you. That's rule number one. But by the way, I don't care what you do in your business, if you don't become this badass, today, all the stuff I'm going to teach you, you're not going to kill it in your business, even if you know what to do. And then rule number two, you got to try to figure out how to kick your own ass every single day. You guys, right now, listen to me. Don't listen to me for entertainment now. Please do not listen to me for entertainment. I am nobody. I promise you, I'm just getting fucking warmed up. Wait till you see what I'm going to do in 2024. I literally live this fucking life. This right here, this is me. This is not stage me. This is me. Okay. You guys know your holes. Everybody write down blind spot. You've got a fucking blind spot, man. Okay, watch this. I want to ask everybody a question. We're driving in the car. You're getting over into the other lane. There's a car, and I can see it, and you're about to swerve into it. Would you like that person to honk the fucking horn and warn you, yes or no? Yes. Most of you, they honk their horn, you give them the fucking finger. That's what I see. A lot of the times when I poke at people's marriages, you get pissed but your marriage is going in the trash can. A lot of you, listen to me, people don't have business problems in most cases. They have personal problems. Today, this fixes all of it, okay? Lastly, how to close anyone. Super fucking simple. If you become this person I'm talking about, you will never miss a cell again. Never. It's the easiest thing in the world for someone to say yes to somebody who's fucking real. Does that make sense? Yes, sir. Do you guys have a bullshit meter? Yeah, so does the rest of the f***ing world. You don't think right now, I was just telling the guys in the back, 99% of f***ing social media is fake. Do you guys get that? Do you guys get that a lot of the people you look up to really aren't the f***ing way they are? You guys know that, right? Okay, what about you? 
What about you? Are you a fucking fraud? Are you a fraud? Are you getting on social media every day? Get telling people, oh, I gotta stay fucking positive, gotta fucking win. Here's a picture of me and my wife. And then you go home and you're a fucking piece of shit. Listen, this is where we're gonna create leaders that'll change this fucking world. This isn't about politics. Look, this is about becoming a great fucking excellent human being and leading your fucking family and changing your generational bloodline. And I swear to God, if you listen to me today, you will create this. And no one can take it away from you. It's a new fucking identity. And people will tell you you're crazy? Yeah, I'm crazy. What do you want me to do? Shut up, be a loser, follow instructions, and be a fucking brokey? Like, is that what they want you to do? Yes. Do you guys think people really want to see you fucking win? You're fucking stupid. They're, yes, you're exactly right. No, they don't want to see you win. And when you go to get what you want, the people around you, you'll learn that most of them never loved you. When you go to get more, they'll say, fuck you. I don't like what you're doing. I think what you're doing is stupid. You're embarrassing the family. Shut your mouth. No one's ever stood up for your family and the first time someone does, it's fucking embarrassing. You know what's embarrassing? Stay in the fucking same. You guys, we're gonna get to teaching. These are the three things I'm about today. Psycho competitor. Number one about being a psycho competitor, there's three forms of competitiveness. Number one, you got the 99 percenters, they don't exist. And by the way, I love you. We have a lot of 99 percenters in here today who are going to make a decision to be in one of these two top boxes right now. Either the 1% or the 0.0001%. You must decide, you must become sold on that, and you must never be fucking reasonable with anything less than I will be the top 0001%. And by the way, don't be fucking arrogant. If you have holes, you must fix them, go to war, work on yourself. Here's the beautiful thing right now, guys. Everybody's asleep. Everybody's asleep. I see all these fucking jokers walking around. You know most of these people, these coaching companies out, they're going to be out of business in a year. You know most of these motherfuckers running around telling people what to do? They're going to be gone in a year. You know a lot of your people right now that are telling you to do this in a year, they're going to be doing something different. You feel me? No ways. Hey guys, I just want to tell you, you're the true one percenters. You made it till the end of the video. Do me a favor, share it with the friend that wants to go to another level. Make sure you like the video, comment below so I know who you are. Set your notifications and then subscribe to the channel. We got daily sales training videos dropping. I'll see you soon.